one we are doing OCR computer science for A level and it's a two year course. The way the course is divided is they have two theory exams and they have one practical project. At Ashbourne we learn visualbasic.net, we learn a bit of Java, we learn a bit of Python. I give students the autonomy to choose whichever programming language they want to use. We start the year by taking them to a robotics workshop and they get really excited about it, they get introduced to programming, they get, they, they get hands-on with all the things that they're doing on the day. Then we always take a trip to Bletchley Park and that really gets the students interested in, um, you know, what are the different ways they can actually use computers to, you know, different fields. We also do uh, lots of day trips, so we would go to Imperial College for talks on computer science. But these clubs are run by the students, so they have the autonomy to choose what they want to do. I just provide the tools and I'm the facilitator and they would just go off and lots of students join our clubs, so it's a lot of fun. Studying computer science at Ashbourne was very fun. The fact that we were learning about devices and technologies that we use on a daily basis and we learned how they work and how they operate. Additionally, uh, I found that my class was very interactive. We did things beyond the scope of the syllabus, so we learned about Raspberry Pis, we use them every now and then. I quite like how our class is quite small um, and I think there's a lot of people in the class you can learn off as they program different ways themselves. Once you learn about algorithms and thinking logically, you see everything in a whole new way and it helps with things like maths because you get to see how to answer a problem in a whole different way. So National Cypher Challenge is a, a cryptography challenge. Every year University of Southampton runs the challenge. They would make live uh, an encrypted text, which is usually a part of a story. And schools, then they have to team up, and then we log in at that particular time. We have to look at the encrypted text, and then we have to try to decipher that text. And together, computer science and maths department, they are participating in the challenge, and we are doing really well. Computer science here at Ashbourne is great. It's really interesting to learn it formally after learning it myself and see which bits I miss. I love the way that it's really, really small and that I have kind of a one-to-one -one connection with my teacher. Not a lot of schools can do that kind of thing.